Welcome to DDoC 2.0. How to customize the dashboard in DDoC 2.0. Once logged into DDoC 2.0, you can customize the view of your dashboards. In the following example, we are on the forecast dashboard. Go to the tree dot menu in the top right corner of your forecast dashboard. Click column options. In the column option, you can 1. Choose which columns to be shown or hidden on your dashboard. 2. Choose the order of the columns on your dashboard. 3. Choose which columns to be kept visible at all times. 4. Choose which columns or columns that your dashboard is sorted by. Now let's go and see how each feature works. 1. Show or hide columns. Use the eye icon to make a column visible or invisible. 2. Set the order of columns. The columns are in the order as listed. Use the handle icon to drag a column up or down to its desired position in the list. 3. Keep columns always visible. The columns in the fixed column section are shown on the left side of your dashboard all the time, regardless if you scroll your screen right or left. Use the handle icon to drag and drop the columns to this section. 4. Set the sorting order. Under the sorting tab, add or remove columns that your dashboard is sorted by. You can add multiple columns and your dashboard will be sorted by these columns in the order as listed. In the following example, we chose the status as the first sorting column. Type status in the field to find the status column. And then choose the forecast as the second sorting column in descending order. Type forecast in the field to find the forecast column and use the arrow to set whether it's descending or ascending order. We can remove any sorting column by clicking the minus sign next to the column. Let's save the column option and we are back to the dashboard. The dashboard now shows the columns we have chosen to be visible, including the fixed columns. The dashboard is now sorted by the status column first and by the forecast column in descending order. The status column shows 1 in the header and the forecast column shows 2 in the header which represents that the status is the first sorting column and the forecast is the second. I hope this was helpful. Goodbye and see you in the next tutorial.